Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel VAC Global Education. My name is Hina and today we are going to discuss about IELTS requirement in United Kingdom. So as I have previously discussed that IELTS is not mandatory in United Kingdom, today we are, we are going to discuss how can we replace IELTS with other alternatives. So in this video, I'm going to cover four alternatives for IELTS. Firstly, your CBSE marks in class 12. Secondly, your um, MOI, which is medium of instruction. Thirdly, your pre-session pathway courses. Fourthly, it's your interview. So there are four options where, where you can uh, replace your IELTS with. So starting with the uh, 12th, uh, 12th board marks. So in English, if you have secured uh, 65 and above, 75 and above, 85 and above, it totally depends upon your courses. And of course, if you're going for post-graduation or going for uh, undergraduation, it totally depends. It depends upon university to university as well. For example, BCU, Birmingham City University, if you secured 65% and above and you are going for a, a undergrad program, which is requiring 6.5 band or 6 band, I think six band, um, it depends upon the courses to courses. So most probably if it's required six bands and you have secure 65% and above in your CBSE board, CICSC board, Tamil board or Andhra Pradesh board or even Maharashtra board, then of course you do not have to appear for your IELTS and you can get an offer letter without your IELTS. Secondly, if uh, they are asking for suppose uh, 6.5 band and above, then the requirement of course increases. It can be 75% and above. 85% and above for 7 band, it again totally depends upon course to course and university to university. For a detailed discussion upon this, please contact us and we can guide you with your IELTS requirement and your board examinations. Secondly, let's talk about your MOI, which is medium of instruction. So medium of instruction is if you have completed your undergraduation degree in English, and definitely that would be a plus point for you and you do not have to require IELTS uh, for your studies. And thirdly, for your pre-sessional pathways, pre-sessional pathways are also really important. So there are a lot of universities offering pre-sessional pathways for the stu for, to the students that have not completed their IELTS and they can get uh, enrolled into pre-sessional pathways and you can get your admission or offer letter without your IELTS requirement. Fourthly, as I have discussed, interview, for example, if you have not secured very good in your IELTS examination and you want to, you know, replace it, then definitely there are some universities offering you for the interviews. That means they will conduct an interview for you to check your spoken English skills. And definitely after that, you will be able to secure your admission there in the university. For more information, please like, subscribe and follow and you can apply through us. We'll definitely help you. Have a nice day. Bye bye.